quick update. Our visas have been approved. We're ready. We got our email notification uh, with both of our temporary residency visas. Uh, so now it's time to essentially get everything ready so that we can leave the U.S. finally. Um, we got to move some stuff out of the house, uh, put it up for sale, do those last minute things to make the house look nice. And uh, yeah, basically just uh, get everything together. So stay tuned and... One other thing. Oh, go ahead. Can you ask about, you know, uh, the marriage license, if anyone knows information about that? Oh, okay. So if anyone has any information out there, anyone seeing this has any information about getting your marriage license registered in Ecuador, let me know. We currently are working with a processor uh, that did our visas, uh, but there's an additional step um, where they're saying, you know, we need to get our marriage registered in Ecuador so that, you know, we can have joint property and things of that nature. Um, really just want to find out if anyone has done it, if they've done it on their own, or if I should just go ahead and pay. Uh, the additional not, fee. Yeah, the additional fee. It's not cheap, but, you know, just want to know if it will be uh, advantageous to us to do it on our own or just go ahead and have them do that as well. So, like I said, you know, just another update. Uh, we'll continue to uh, post updates, uh, especially since we're going to be moving some things in and out of our shed and garage and uh, things of that nature. So stay tuned. Try to get anything? No, like and subscribe.